Hundreds of miles away on vacation, an Albuquerque veteran says his home was broken into and thieves stole dozens of pieces of jewelry. But it's not the financial loss he's mad about. It's what the unique pieces meant to his family. Decades of history and memories. News 13's Chris McKee is in the Newspex with more. Crystal, the family who had all of these unique jewels stolen, is hoping pictures will now help them get some of it back. They're valuable to us. It's not easy for Ted to list off what's been taken from him. Because of the nature of the ruby, it's probably not going to happen, me, me being able to replace that. Jewelry that's worth more in feeling than price. They're personal, and it's a military family that's been all over the world. Back in April, Ted and his wife went on vacation to the Grand Canyon. Two days from getting out of the bottom, an emergency call came from their Sandia Heights home near Black Hawk and Roadrunner. And the first thing my daughter said was, you've been robbed. Someone broke in, kicked down the door, and stole a jewelry box. Inside, around 70 pieces that Ted, an Air Force veteran, collected from around the world. Each piece with a story. Purchased in uh, Lebanon. Ruby earrings bought near his father's hometown in Lebanon. Mementos from places his family was stationed. Bracelet that we purchased in Peru. Even wedding gifts for Ted's wife. Zuni cross that I had made 50 years ago to give to my wife on our wedding, and it's gone. The stuff that can't be replaced. There's her class ring from the class of 61 in Hawaii. Ted is now hoping the photos of these unique items will help. We're not a rich family, we're a military family, and uh, none of the items were purchased for at, at great cost, but they're valuable to us. Valuable memories that he and his wife are now missing. It's the sentimental, it's the personal value that's worth more to me and I feel violated that way. And Ted says the stolen jewelry is worth tens of thousands of dollars, but because thieves stole so many items, he says none of it individually though was insured because each peach piece wasn't worth that much on its own. Back to you, Crystal. All right, thanks, Chris. The victim says other neighbors have reported a stolen car and other recent home burglaries in the area. BCSO is still investigating that case. Police